so hey angels what's up it's your girl alicia and i'm back today with another video and i got a message for you guys from the lord today before we dive into this word today i need to take a second and welcome all of the new angels to the academy this is a god ordained safe space for men and women to heal to be vulnerable and to grow into the fullness of god so if this is your first time to the channel please make sure you hit that subscribe button come over and join the family if you are already one of my angels you guys know I love you so much. And without further ado, let's just dive right into this video. So, hey, angels. Hey, family. How are you guys doing today? I hope you guys are doing well. Before we dive into this word today, I need to take a second and thank all of my moderating brothers and sisters. I love you guys so much. Thank you guys for holding down the chat, helping me keep a safe and clean community here. I need to take a second and thank my Super Chat family. I love you guys so much. You guys are the absolute best. Thank you guys for sewing into God's vision here on the channel. And so do you guys got your Bibles? You got to know I got mine. Comment down below. I got my Bible, sis. I got my Bible so you know it's real. Glory be to God. And so before we dive into this word today, you guys know that we need to take a second and allow the Holy Spirit in. Although I know he's already here because he's with me. But you guys know that we do nothing here without God. And so Father God, in the name of Jesus, I thank you, Lord. I thank you for everything it is that you're doing for your people in this season, Lord Jesus. I ask that you lead and guide this conversation today, Lord Jesus. Have your way. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. Okay, Angel, so God told me to title this message today, Your Patience Will Pay Off. And so hear me by the Spirit of the Lord, family. If this is your word today, maybe you've been feeling a bit impatient about certain things happening in your life. Maybe you've been waiting on a promise and praying out to God and thinking, God, when is this thing going to come to pass? Well, this is your word confirmation that it is coming to pass and that your patience will pay off. And so I want to start this word off in scripture, family. Get your Bibles. You guys know what I always say. If you got the Bible app on the phone, then that's fine. We still going to read it together as a family. And so God led me over to James chapter five, verse seven through eight. Come on, y'all. Let's read it. And it says, dear brothers and sisters, be patient as you wait for the Lord's return. Consider the farmers who patiently wait for the rains in the fall and in the spring. They eagerly look for the valuable harvest to ripen. You too must be patient. Take courage. For the coming of the Lord is near. And so glory be to God and God bless this word today. Let me see if I can break this thing down to you guys the way the Holy Spirit gave it to me. In these verses, James encourages believers to exercise patience and perseverance while awaiting the return of Jesus. And in this same way, you must be patient and persevere and endure through trials and difficulties while trusting God's timing for his purposes to be fulfilled. And so don't let this go over your head, family, because the book of James was written to a group of Christians who were abused, taken advantage of, and persecuted. Is this your word today? These Christians were facing great opposition that many had to flee their homes in search of safety. And so James wrote this letter under the direction of the Holy Spirit. He wanted them to know how to live out their faith in the middle of difficulty. And so their faith was being tested. And James wanted to make sure that they passed. So if you read through the verses, he gives the picture of a farmer. The farmer prepares the ground, plants the seeds, and wait patiently for the crops to rise. And so don't let this go over your head, family, because there are many variables that he takes into consideration. Some of these are in his control and some of these are out of his control. Yet and still he patiently and hopefully wait for the crops to produce enough fruits. And this is that season, family. And so if this is your word today, your life is the same. You expect that your hard work will pay off, but you are to try your best to make the right decisions and trust that God will turn even the worst of circumstances into something beautiful. And so this is your word confirmation that it is coming and that your patience will pay off. And so understand that God gives the increase, but you can't reap a harvest if you never plant a seed. And so I just want to encourage you guys today to keep planting and to be patient and know that God is using your difficult moment to help you build endurance and that God is bringing all things into order. So don't worry. 
And so I love you guys so much. I pray that you guys receive this word today from the heavens above. If this is your word today, comment down below, sis. This is my word today. If you would like to sow a seed into the ministry, all the information is down below in the description. I also have a PO box. I'll drop it here for you guys. If you guys would like to send over a money order or a check, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe before you guys get out of here. If you would like to get your holy oils, the link is down below in the description. And so I love you guys so much. And that is the end of our video today, family. But always remember the secret to success. Say it with me, y'all. Put God first. Always be determined. And consistency is key. Period. I love you guys. And I will see you guys in our next video. God willing. Bye, angels. Mwah.